She was completely paralyzed from the forelegs. Only her head could move. The vet just looked at her and was like, well, she probably got hit by a car. There's not much to do. I think we should just put her to sleep. You could definitely see it in her eyes. She did want to fight. So the next day we went to, to the second vet. We did x-rays, blood tests, an ultrasound, an MRI. There was absolutely nothing that we could find that was wrong with her. And I just took her home with me. First few days, she could lift her head a little bit to like try and get in the food bowl that we were placing. She could only move her head, but with her head, she was just trying to give us head rubs. It took around 10 days until she started making the biscuits with her front paws. Oh my God, how did that make you feel? We just wanted to cry. I think we did cry. <laughs> <laughs> Felt like there's actually hope that this cat might walk. Every day you could see that she was a little bit stronger and a little bit stronger. trying to do so much physiotherapy to build up the strength and the muscles so she could support herself in the end. Every day you can see the progression, every day you can see the strength that she was building up. Then we're going to try to find her a home. So we just posted a video just telling her story. It did kind of blow up. And we received more than like 500 applications. We found a, an amazing family in Belgium. Slowly. Little by little. 